Starving, thirsty, and all alone on a pillar of rock in the desert, Joe keeps waiting for new mystical visions that could give a sense to his life. Hey, Lou Mary, what are you doing all alone on that pillar of rock? You tell me, I have no idea how I got up here, not to mention why. Usually, stylites like you climb pillars to be closer to heaven. In my case, I think it may be more to be away from whatever is down there. Oh, is it so bad on the ground? I guess so, otherwise I wouldn't be up here. So you like it better to stand on that rock, alone, and starving, rather than being on the ground with other people like you? What other people? There are only snakes and scorpions down there, and I have a better view from up here. And what do you see? I see you. We are having some nice little conversation here. It's been a while since I talked with someone. You mean that you are fool enough to believe you are actually talking with the moon right now? I'm no astronomer, but I thought that you were the moon. Or are you just a star with serious dietary problems? I'm just a figment of your imagination, and basically, you're just talking with yourself. And if you'd listen to this dialogue, you'd see there's definitely something wrong in your head. So, which is the wrong part, you or me? Look, this is getting weird. Just do me a favor and wake up. And the next time that you feel in the mood to talk, just dream of someone different, please. Done. I knew that isolation and starvation can cause visions, but I hoped for something more mystical. What kind of meaning am I supposed to get from this stuff? Yeah, pal. Whatever you say, I feel like that too.